Now at 11, it could be the biggest jewel heist in U.S. history. And tonight, Eyewitness News has obtained the body cam video as deputies first responded to this SoCal truck stop. This body cam video raising new questions about how much as $100 million in diamonds, gold, and precious gems could vanish from the back of this Brinks semi-truck. Eyewitness News reporter Leanne Suter joining us now with that new video and what it's revealing tonight. Leanne. Mark, that body cam video capturing the moment the Brinks guards realized just how many bags of jewels and gems were stolen in the brazen heist fit for a Hollywood movie. Nelson says 73 pieces went on this truck. Well, then there's 23 missing. Four, four, 24 missing. A stunning surprise as the two Brinks guards realized just how much of the multi-million dollar stash in the semi was stolen by thieves. My clients were led to believe that they were going to have armored transport. They were going to have armed guards who were going to securely transport these goods. Attorney Jerry Kroll represents the jewelers who say they lost an estimated $100 million worth of gems, jewelry, and high-end watches. The valuables all part of a traveling gem and jewelry show moving from San Francisco to Pasadena. Those orange bags are the highest value loans. And that's exactly what the thieves went after. It happened last July when the guards stopped at a truck stop in the grapevine. One guard sleeping in the semi, the other went in to eat, returning half an hour later to find the lock on the back of the truck missing. But the seal, but the seal is broken, and that's clearly fresh cut, and there's this clearly fresh work here, yeah. right there. There's fresh work dust. We don't consider that guarding the goods. And what happens in those 27 minutes? My client's jewelry is stolen. And again, what's reported to be the largest theft in U.S. history. That's, that's pretty expensive. Four bags. Correct. That's a, I mean, that's a, a lot of stuff. Yeah. Kroll says the victims haven't received a dime in insurance money as the two sides are now locked in dueling lawsuits over the exact value of the missing haul. My clients placed their trust in Brinks, and they entrusted their, their livelihoods. The deputies in that video say it's clear the thieves knew exactly what they were after and when to strike. So far, no sign of the missing jewels and no arrests. The Sheriff's Department and the FBI still investigating. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV and Roku to watch on your TV.